Some Atlanta VA employees took to the streets to protest the lack of adequate protective equipment. Our Bo Beth Yates tells us the group says each day they go to work, they put their lives at risk because they're not being provided masks that can protect them against the coronavirus. Yes, the health care workers here at Atlanta VA say they're not being provided the proper protective mask, and now they're worried they could get the virus. Nurses and the public life is at risk. We don't want to spread this infection. A group of VA employees took to the streets to voice their concerns about not being provided the proper respiratory mask. The nurses are quite disappointed because they feel like they've been failed. We don't have adequate protective, personal protective equipment needed to provide safe care. And um, nurses are being rationed. Uh, the, equipment. the group says they're being provided surgical masks that do not protect from the coronavirus and only when they're interacting with patients who tested positive for the virus are they given a mask with a respirator, a process they say puts them in danger. We never feel just safe for us. We can't catch it. We just want to make sure that we don't. In a statement, the VA said the health, safety and protection of veterans and staff is their top priority. The document went on to say they're working 24 seven to continue providing the appropriate personal protective equipment for VA employees as per the CDC guidelines. But the nurses protesting say those guidelines are the problem because they do not provide adequate protection. The CDC has lowered the standards and what they um, can and cannot do. So what we're saying is that standard is lessened. We should be able to have adequate PPE at all times. It's important to know that those we spoke to say this issue isn't just impacting nurses here at Atlanta VA, but healthcare workers all across the country. Fighting for our vets, Bo Beth Yates, CBS 46 News.